In this video, I'm going to show you how to use an AI software called Creatify AI. It is a mind blowing software that allows you to paste the URL of any product in there and then get the actual video that you can upload to TikTok, right? But I'm going to show you in this tutorial how to use this multiple different ways to use it to get the best video possible that has the highest likelihood to actually perform and get you sales, right? But before anything else, we need to nail the product and the product market fit, right? If we have a page that has a TikTok shop attached to it or has access to TikTok affiliates, right? And we have a product that people don't want, number one, or a product that doesn't fit that audience for that page, we're still gonna struggle even with the best video in the world. So the first thing that we need to do is figure out a product that's proven, that's already gone viral, that other people are currently right now having success with, that we can also create videos and kind of siphon off a piece of that pie to get some sales ourselves, right? And we're using Creatify AI because it's really easy to get a lot of videos up. We can make them as high quality as possible and kind of prove the concept without spending a lot of money or a lot of time on creating videos ourselves, right? We're essentially just throwing fishing rods in the water, seeing if fish bite, and if they bite and we get a few sales, then at that point, we know that that product's good and we'll reinvest a lot more back into it, whether we order it to ourselves and at that point, create more UGC content, or if we then pay somebody to do it for us, or if we order videos from another site like viral e-com ads or whatever, right? But you can still get a decent amount of sales just using this AI software. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. So the first thing that you need to do is you actually need to find a product within your niche, right? So you want to open up the product marketplace. It doesn't matter if you're selling from your shop or if you're actually just a TikTok affiliate, you need to find a product within here that's selling well, that's in your niche. Okay. So one of the pages that I actually just got to 5,000 followers recently was a fitness page. Okay. So I plan on potentially selling things like pre-workout supplements, health supplements, protein powder, or pretty much any lifting thing. One of the things that I saw go viral recently, that's on almost every lifting page is these wrist straps. So essentially you just strap in and it allows you to lift more. I see them everywhere. So I'm definitely going to try to sell that. But if I were trying to find a product on the product marketplace currently right now, I might scroll through and kind of see what products fit me. So right here we have the infused sleep gummies. Those don't really work. If we keep scrolling, we want to kind of just find a product. We, we're just going to spend like five, 10 minutes looking for some of the products that are actually selling well. So right here, the creatine on the right, creatine monohydrate power from nature bell has sold 5,000. So we might want to add that to our showcase. So in that case, if we wanted to sell this product, we'd obviously click add to the showcase, but we click on the product. And then you can see from here, not only does it tell you how much are in stock and that's crucial because I made the mistake before of actually adding a product that only had like 20 in stock and it sold out relatively fast. And so while I thought I had a great video, the product that was linked to it was out of stock and it didn't matter, right? So don't make that mistake. Make sure that if you're actually going to spend the time or the effort or, or the money to create a video, that you're actually linking to a product that won't go out of stock fast. This one won't. So that's the first thing that we noticed. Now there's other videos down here on the bottom videos with this product, as you can see, and it hasn't really had that many viral hits yet. So you can see the one on that's got 10,000 views is probably the one that we'd want to mimic here because that's the easiest way to actually get some results fast is just do what's already working for other people, right? And TikTok literally shows you what other people and what other videos have sold this product successfully, right? So that's what we'd want to do. If we were picking this product, we probably want to go after that video and kind of make slight variations of it. But let's find something else. So if we continue to scroll here, we're just seeing like what's suggested to us because typically what they suggest is either what's selling well now or they think fits you. So just kind of search around. You could also type something into the search bar really fast. So if you wanted to type fitness or workout or treadmill or supplement or whatever it is or protein, like you know the keywords that fit your niche, you can search them in, right? So if we typed in like pre-workout, let's see what the best pre-workout is currently on TikTok shop. So right here, this echo creatine is literally $13, which is an absolute, that's crazy price, which is exactly why it sold almost 157,000 units. So you can see there's a ton of videos that have gone viral selling this product. And so this probably will be something that we'd want to sell because the price is super low and you can sell higher price products on TikTok shop. Don't get me wrong. I've done it. But if you're just getting your feet 
feet wet and you're not good at it yet, definitely try to go after lower end products because it's going to be an easier conversion because people aren't going to think as much about spending $13 when they might think about spending $80 on a product or $50 on a product, right? You definitely can still sell them. I do all the time, but the path of least resistance is kind of where you want to get started if you don't know what you're doing yet, right? So what I would do if I was going to sell this product is I wouldn't just create a script out of my out of thin air out of what I thought was good, right? I wouldn't look at the product details and product features and kind of write what I think might work. I would want to go after proven scripts and replicate them and put my own spin on it, right? And so I actually found a product and a video that we're going to mimic right here right now. And I downloaded that video to my computer, as you can see here. It's literally just a forearm blaster or like a wrist like roller, I guess, to increase the strength of your forearms. But a lot of shops were selling it and selling it successfully. So I downloaded a video that went viral selling this recently. And I'm going to take you through the whole tutorial really fast of how I would replicate this video and make it my own, upload it to my TikTok and hopefully get some sales with it. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to transcribe the video, right? What's the actual script that's working in this video? There's many ways to do that. You can't actually upload this to YouTube and use a transcribing service because it's a short, most of them are going to be shorts. And in my experience, most of those like free transcribers with YouTube videos don't work with shorts. It has to be a long form video. So what you could do is you could use a software like Veed and that will transcribe it for you. Although you do need to pay, you could also just play it and then open up like word on your phone or open up word on your computer and just have it transcribe. Right? So if I opened up word right here, if I just press dictate like this, it'll just listen to what I'm saying and write the words on the computer for me. Right? So like, let me show you if I just played this video from my phone, we dictate it. This is an example of how word dictates different things on the computer based on what it's hearing. Like, see how cool that is. It just reads it off. Right. And it's free. You don't need to pay for any software. It will then at that point, give you the script for free instantly, which you can then take in and put your own spin on it. You do want to keep like the bones of the script. So typically speaking, you want to keep the hook like that first, like five to 10 second hook in the beginning, because that's what works best to actually get people to stay on the video. Right. You need to build from there. But here's the original script. I literally wrote it down. We brought our favorite forearm blast to the gym to see if gym bros were up for the challenge. Let's see how he does. This simple yet effective design is designed and you can see the exact script that I wrote down right here, right? Now I did take this original one out when I rewrote it to kind of put my own spin on it because I know personally that I'm not gonna be taking it to a gym to test other people. And I don't really have any B-roll that makes sense with that because I'm gonna be using Creative High AI for this example. So I took that out as you can see, and I just put a new intro in there that says, you've never got a forearm workout like this before. But then I pretty much kept the same overall script. I kept the main next point and I kept the call to action at the end. So it changed into you've never got a forearm workout like this before. This simple yet effective piece of equipment is designed to target and strengthen your forearms with every roll, which is from their script already. It improves grip strength, which leads to lifting more, which leads to bigger gains, bro. And the best part is we're having a sale right now. Head over to the TikTok shop before it's too late. And that's literally their CTA as well, which apparently worked for them, right? Now we have the product. We have the script that we hope is going to be a winner because it's very similar to theirs. Now we need to make the actual video. So here we are on Creatify AI. It's going to one, suggest you amazing scripts, and you'll see that here in a second. You can also see I literally use it myself. I've upgraded the plan myself. That's how much I believe in it. I'm not just telling you you should do it. I literally use this. It's going to give you several variations of the video, which you can then just post to TikTok yourself, or you can use it for B-roll because what it does is it takes all the stuff from the listing and the URL of the product that you give it, and it turns it and kind of edits it around with that product and the videos on there so that it's creating an entirely new video that you can then post to TikTok as well, right? Even if it's your voiceover or the AI's voiceover. So I'll show you a little demo here of this now, right? So the first thing that you need to do, obviously, is use this software. The next thing that you need to do is you need to find that product on somewhere that has a lot of information and reviews or or product pictures or videos already. It's really easy to just go to Amazon because first and foremost, there's typically speaking that product on Amazon or, or a product very, very similar. And also on top of that, you're going to get a lot of information because they typically have a well written description, product pictures, product title, features, etc. And a lot of them have a lot of reviews and a lot of review videos, which 
which is perfect to create these videos for the AI to actually draw from, right? So I found it right here, this yes for all wrist forearm blaster with 2,700 reviews. So let's click on the listing. As you can see here, plenty of pictures, information for the AI, and it even has six videos on the listing and it probably has a lot of review videos as well. So what do we do? Well, all we need to do is just use the URL. So we copy the URL of this product. We take it into Creatify AI, create new video, paste the product URL right there, super complicated. And then you could do analyze URL. And it's literally gonna pull the product name, the product description, and all the media from that listing, right? So you see right here, it's got the pictures and it's also got all the videos on that listing, right? Now this is really cool. So you could then next at this point, pick the aspect ratio, pick the video length. If you wanted to optionally put in your target audience, say you only want to market to like, you know, 18 year old gym bros, whatever it is, right? You can tell the demographic there, the age range, and whether it's male or female or any keywords or anything like that to describe your audience, obviously then click next. And it's going to generate your AI scripts, right? Now you can use these AI scripts and you'll see that a lot of them are actually pretty good. Surprisingly, some of them aren't, but a lot of them are. So you could also, if you don't like any of these generate more scripts, right? And this part is completely free, right? You don't need to actually sign up and use Creatify AI and like upgrade to get the script. You have to be able to export the videos with no watermark. You have to upgrade and pay for the software. But if you were just strapped trying to look for like good scripts or a product, you can get to this part completely free. And it actually does a really good job of generating scripts, right? So what's an example of that? Ever felt like your workouts are missing something? That was me until I discovered the yes for all wrist and forearm blaster. Now, if you didn't want yes for all in there, you could just edit that out by literally clicking edit, deleting yes for all. And then you could say that was me until I discovered this wrist and forearm blaster. Trust me, it's a game changer for strength and grip. Get yours now. AI literally generated that for us. We did not give it any other information other than the URL. It's crazy. And you can generate as many scripts as your heart desires. It will keep pumping them out for you. Or to go back just to show you, because there's all this media in here, it's gonna try to use the best parts of this media and the product description to come up with a good video for us, right? And so a little hack that I definitely recommend you try out is delete all the product images so it's just using the videos if possible possible from your product listing so that you're getting the best parts and it doesn't kind of flash into pictures, which can actually work better sometimes. Don't get me wrong. But if you're just starting out, I definitely recommend watching these videos that it has and picking the best videos for you, right? Now, I don't want to use that. I wanted to actually use a bunch of them for this example, but I'm just saying you should test that out because some of my best videos are ones where I've deleted all the product images here and then watch the videos and only pick like one or two of the best videos. And I'm not listening to what they're saying because this is just going to be the B-roll of the actual video. I'm just looking for the product being demonstrated, right? Somebody using the product because that's going to be in the video, right? So that's a little hack to lead all the ones that are bad here. But again, just for just to show you an example, I'm not going to for this example. So we're going to go back. We're going to click next again. And now here's where you could use those AI scripts, like I said before, right? Or since we've already got a proven script because we spent the time to actually go and make a proven script our own that already went viral, we can paste that in there, right? So you can use these AI scripts. They actually do pretty well from time to time if you pick a good one, right? And like I said before, some of these are pretty good. Or you can pick the DIY approach and just paste your script in there. And that way you're using a proven script with a proven hook that's very, very similar to a video that's gone viral already. You're They're gonna do the voiceover for you and just put over some other B-roll of the product being used. So it's a very similar video and has a high likelihood to also do well for you. So then you'd click next and it's gonna start generating the video and give us several different variations that we can pick from, right? And you don't have to be charge any of the credits or pay for anything until you decide to export, right? So you can play around with this until you find a really good video and then only export once you're happy with the video, right? And this software has been mind blowing for me because it really takes a lot of the time out of the equation. I've tried so many different ways to create these videos and they either take a lot of money by either outsourcing it to another UGC creator, right? To do it for you or to another editor to overlay B-roll on it for you. Or it takes a lot of time, right? Which might be the best route if you don't have a lot of money to begin with, right? Then you do want to spend your time and your sweat equity creating the videos yourself and editing them together, whether you're doing it somewhere like Final Cut Pro, Adobe Premiere Pro, or just on CapCut or on the TikTok editor itself. All those can work, but it takes a lot of time to pump those videos out. But this 
actually gives you high quality B-roll on top of a proven script already. And so you can upload several variations of this and kind of get a feeler out and test to see if people are gonna buy into this product and if it's actually gonna do well or not. So just to show you some examples here, you can just go with the overall B-roll approach here of them using the product. Like this before, this simple yet effective piece of equipment is designed to target and strengthen your forearms with every roll. Improved grip strength leads to lifting more. And obviously this guy isn't the one talking here, so it looks a little bit off, but he's kind of sh showing and demonstrating the product. Which leads to bigger gains, bro. And the best part is but based on if we did or didn't like this, right? Like if we didn't like him in there, what we could do is just go back and then deselect that video and tell it to reroll into a new one so that he's not in there and all the other images are, right? So that's what you might wanna try just to get a good video, right? But there's also just to show you other variations of this video. So you can get an AI person talking. Never got a forearm workout like this before. This and this typically is what I've been doing a lot lately that's had the best results, either the AI guy green screen talking in the bottom corner about the product also being shown. I don't, something about that retains the audience a little bit better in my opinion, or just going with the full-on product video here on the left that just shows the b-roll both of those have been the best approaches for me and when you're watching the actual don't pay attention to the lips of the guy here and what he's saying because it looks off in the actual preview otherwise you could just rip this video and they would you know they wouldn't charge you for it but when you actually render and export it it is synced up perfectly and it actually looks like an actual human is talking you can barely tell unless you like know it's ai generated a lot of people are not going to notice right so here's an example of one that i rendered and exported you've never Never got a forearm workout like this before. This simple yet effective piece of equipment is designed to target and strengthen your forearms with every roll. Improve grip strength. So pretty good. Again, what we'd want to do ideally is go back and and take this guy's video out. So we'd go all the way back to these videos right here, and we'd find the video of him, not that one. Hi everybody. Hi everybody, I'm Dr. C. That's the one right there. So this one. So we would delete that video so that they can't use that. We might even delete a lot of these pictures and then we'd re-roll it again and see what it comes up with now without that guy so that the B-roll is different, right? But that is how I'm using this software, rewriting other proven scripts and taking a lot of the time out of the equation so that it's not 100% automated, but 90% automated. It saves so much of my time. It doesn't cost that much compared to outsourcing to an editor or spending a lot of my time doing it myself and this way you can test a lot of products with a lot of different video variations very quickly and just like i said in the beginning the whole idea here is of course it would be great if one of these videos went viral blew up and you made a lot of money right that would be great and that's definitely possible i've had some of them do pretty well but the whole strategy with using this is just kind of throwing in feelers right throwing that metaphorical fishing rod into the water and seeing where the fish are biting on what products on what product scripts and then at that point once maybe you upload a video like this and you get five sales with that video and it gets like 2,000 views or 5,000 views, then you know you've got a proven product, a proven video script. And that at that point is when you want to spend more time, potentially more money into creating that script with a better video with better B-roll.